closed. You don't look the sort who can afford to turn down legitimate work. <coughs> what do you want? How about we start with a light? Well, you gotta name this? Elizabeth. You can call me Elizabeth. What can I do for you? There's a girl who needs to be found. Maybe you've seen her? This girl... This girl's dead. You know her. You'll see dozens of her type down by the docks or the slums in Apollo Square. Orphans. With Fontaine's charity shut. No place for them. But her you know. As I said, girl's dead. Lost. Look, I don't know where you get... Lost isn't dead. Name your radar will pay you for this work. You'd do this one gratis, wouldn't you? I don't follow. Something tells me you will. my instincts were correct. Where's Sally? I don't know, but I know someone who does. Follow me. What's this girl to you? What I need from her is my business. But I know where to start looking. Something tells me a man with your particular talents could be useful. Red means what stop. are they? Green Where have you been? Go. Cabin in Arcadia? Little, little sisters. Know. Atom factories. It's grotesque. Compromise? Is that why we came to Rapture? I could come. Sisters. How long have you been in Rapture? Well, let's just say I don't get out much. You've got eyes and ears, don't you? If I wanted to share my life story, Mr. DeWitt, I would write my memoirs. If I learned anything about Rapture, that it was a place where people understood to mind their own business. Where are we headed? The man we need to see is in the Garden of the Muses. How do you know? My sources are my own, Mr. DeWitt. If you have better information as to the whereabouts of your girl, I suggest you avail yourself of it. Where are you taking me? When's the last time you saw Sally? What? She was taken from you, wasn't she? How do you know this? She was taken. Down at Surprise. You were playing the tables and... She disappeared. And? Cop friend of mine, Sullivan, says they found her floating in the docks. You see the body? Look. Did you see the body? This world values children, not childhood. There's a profit to be made and men who make it. I'm taking you to one of them. <laughs> Mr. DeWitt, you all right? I'm fine. I just get these spells sometimes. I'll pass. Refreshments, sir. Madam? We're fine, thanks. <laughs> Mr. 
Mr. DeWitt. I'll find my source inside of that clan. What does that lunatic have to do with Sal? Private party. No entry without invitation. We'll see about that. Which business do you represent, sir? Uh, business? Yes, which business? DeWitt Investigations. Mr. Cohen does not truck with private detectives. Masks of invitation went to artists and craftsmen alone. I'm with the artist struggle. We're expected... No mask, no entry. Stuff shirt. These invitation masks he spoke of, they must have gone out to local artisans. Well, I guess we'll have to persuade someone to loan us one. The business of Rapture is business. It says it's sponsored by the artist struggle, the Golden Rule, and Rapture Records. Because those stores would be as good a place to start as any. Questions for you. Yes, of course. I'm interested in this piece. Ah, excellent. You've an eye, haven't you, miss? It's a natural sapphire and diamond, 18 karat gold ring, fully hallmarked for Paris, 1887. That's a lot of fine talk about a stolen ring. I beg your pardon? Right out of her coffin in Twilight Fields. Cohen Did you sends think those we wouldn't know? Some kind of box. Damn. The assurances of a grave else. robber are of no interest. You hand the ring back, the matter will remain between you and me. You come into my shop and talk this trash? I don't think so. Hit the bricks, you tramp! Or I'll see to it they hit you. Get you your hands off me! Oh. Oh. Hmm. Might be best if we were gone when he wakes up. Any luck? Nothing. Let's find another shop. It's temporary. Where should we look next? Upstairs at the artist's struggle, or rapture records straight ahead? The great gene guides. Dr. Steinman told me he... You see that dish I walked in with? Will you give her the start treatment, pal? It'll make it worth your while. Of course, right away. It's by Trinet, but of course, covered by Mr. Reinhardt. Oh, it's lovely. Gotta find that Isn't box. That Nothing. Well, only one place left. Place left, though. And if that proves to be fruitless, we'll cross that bridge when we get to it. Fontaine got taken out by Ryan's gun. Hey, pal, you want to help out the little lady? Yes, of course. Interesting, isn't it? The original Sander Cohen. He calls it miasma. I'm sorry, but I'm, I know precious little about it. Oh, I would like so much to understand. You've given me so much to think about. I, 
I feel a trifle swoony. Would, would you mind if, if I return tomorrow for further education? I shall be here at your service. Until tomorrow. Located the mask. No time to charm. All right, it's best we head back to Cohen's. Buy a piece of work back with those shopkeeps. You got a bit of the grift. For that, you can thank my father. Oh yeah. He was a man comfortable in a variety of roles. Very well. Mr. Cohen awaits your participation at his performance. So who is this fellow Cohen? Some sort of underworld figure? Worse. He's an artist. An artist who kidnaps children? Cohen's muse is a bit more diverse. I've seen his type. Gets an idea in his head, end a conversation. Don't matter who gets hurt. front of my muse, my muse shall not be mocked. Fitzpatrick! Please! The stick! And for God's sake! Ah! My muse shall not be mocked! Get them out of here! There shall be no failure on my canvas. <laughs> oh, there's no room in rapture anymore. For the artist. Who are you? Name's DeWitt. Is that right? My. <laughs> this one's a real biscuit. Isn't he a biscuit, lady? <laughs> Ask a few questions. Questions? Yes. Yes. It is the work of man to ask. It is the work of the artist to answer. You've seen this girl, haven't you? We artists see more than most. You are more than you claim to be, little songbird. Are you not? Watch this one, DeWitt. She'll take you where you don't want to go. But I know the child in that photo is important to you. So many children flit, flit, flit away. I know where the girl is. And I will send you to her in exchange. All I ask is a dance. What? I see something in you, too. Art strips away artifice. Show me who you are, and I will show you where you need to go. Come, son of a bitch. Mr. DeWitt. Dance with me. Come, come, dance! I 
shudder to think what greater price he might care to extract. Fitzpatrick! Beauty and pain. They can be no more separated than birth and blood. What do you think Cohen's customers do with the children? Do they? Sometimes. But those types like the capital of people like Ryan and Suchon. That's a blessing. You saw those little sisters? You so sure? But if Su Chong had Sally, I'd know it. How? As I tied him to a chair and asked him. So? For 15 hours. I don't know what to make of you, Mr. DeWitt. No, 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 no! Listen, we're not gonna keep- Fitzpatrick! <laughs> Mr. DeWitt! Are you alright? I'm fine. You were dreaming. You kept saying your daughter's name, Sally. She's not my daughter. I thought... Pain and beauty! To an artist, they are parent and child. Cohen? I'm sending you to find your... young one. <laughs> no need to thank me. I'm not so sure you'll like what you find. Look. Fontaine's. Ryan sent the whole thing to the bottom. But it's a prison now. Why would Cohen have sent Sally there? I don't know. Everyone has needs. I merely provide a service for those who have the means to pay. You'll find your little bird in the housewares department. How many people do you suppose Ryan's got locked up in that place? Enough. Fontaine had amassed something near an army. Now they're down there, spliced up and wild. All right, there's a dock up ahead. Takes a cold son of a bitch to do that to a living person. What's that? Burial at sea. You read your residency contract with Ryan Industries? In perpetuity, we're all buried at sea. Comfortable. Keep your eyes open. There seem to be some supplies this way, Mr. DeWitt. It's Booker. What? Just call me Booker. If it's all the same to you, let's leave it at Mr. DeWitt. Look up there. Let's have another look around. Perhaps we'll be able to find something to get us up and over. Yeah, you see that too? Looks like some doorway into another place in time. I do, that Could be. Skyhook. Skyhook? You mean the air 
grabber? Kids use them to ride around up on the new mobiles. Air grabber? Huh. Constants and variables. Constants and what? Never mind. Goddamn grabber stuck. Mr. DeWitt! Someone's coming! Come back! I want the frosting! All right, I got the grabber unjammed. He nose to the grindstone! Mr. DeWitt, look. Housewares. That's where Cohen said we'd find Sally. The store ran trams between the three buildings. We'll need to avail ourselves of that. Assuming it still works. Optimism, Mr. DeWitt. It helps in situations like this. Did you come to Rapture? Oh, it was, uh, geez, I guess around 51? No, 48? That's a rather large gap. Time. Life I had before. Sort of becomes a blur. 49. 49 for sure. Damn. You look a mess, Mr. DeWitt. Just keep your eyes open for splicers. They can do us a whole lot worse. Here, little birdies. Eat it up. Well, it, it's good for you, you know? I've never heard of birds that didn't like seeds. What's, what's the matter with you? Do, do you think it's poison? How long have you been told by me? That splicer had no problem freezing a path for himself before. I'm sure he'll be happy to do the same for us. I have no doubt you'll prove persuasive. We all need a great change and a great change. Mr. DeWitt, look. An ice rink. Be good at places any to look for our new friend. He says it's on the top floor. So we go up. Let me see that. Oh, have matters progressed so little? I could turn this with a rake pick. Done. Where'd you learn that? Oh, it's something I picked up a long time ago. Our frozen friend leaves a hell of a trail. Just let me in, okay? Fontaine? Uh, he said we're all lethal down here now. Uh.
Did I lock the door? Did I lock it? Prisoners are brought in. One of your piece of shit turrets. Bam! Both kneecaps. Now I'm likely a cripple locked in a jail, surrounded by maniacs. I haven't even been paid, but I don't care. Just get me out of here! Mr. DeWitt, grab that lockpick.
Of my first play, the Herald said, A dead whale has washed up at the Schubert Theater and stinks a little more with each passing night. <laughs> the Tribune called my first opera as having the effect of canceling out all of Mozart's classics in a single caterwaul. And now, critics take me to task for my humanitarian work. If I were not there, to find a home for these orphans, would these belly acres take my place? <laughs> An artist once said, All critics should be assassinated. I just might take him up on that.
even seem sane. Nothing beats your first splice. From there, it's all downhill. The frozen frosties, the jockeys who will hand you a thousand volts as soon as look at you. You sound sympathetic. They will be the first sons of bitches who found an answer at the bottom of a bottle. And once you see them go all weak at the knees at the sight of a little sister and all her Adam, they cut a less sympathetic figure. Jolts of shock jockey? You familiar with shock jockey? More than you could know. Let's look around. Maybe there's a store ain't been ransacked by splicers yet. Done. I've been on 
sabbatical for going on. Fifteen years now. I get some work, but I want to get back to real. <laughs> Incapable of great. Insufficient postage.
Looks like the plasma department is back that way. I'm sure we'd find something useful there. Locked. Elizabeth? I'll see what I can do. There you go. To forget the future, we first clear away the debris of the past. Lock up all of Fontaine's followers in a department store. I needed somewhere to put Fontaine's button, but why not shut down the competition in the bargain? But I thought Andrew Ryan was all about free markets and open competition. All those ideas lose their luster when the quarterly earnings come in and you find the other guys eating your lunch. Either way, Fontaine's dead.
Unless I say so. You got it. If anyone comes near that bottle without permission, is it dead man? I have Eve. You need this. Perfect timing. Picking. I can Mr. DeWitt. The plasmid? Have you forgotten what we came for? Damn it, that son of a bitch drank every last bottle of old man winter. I think I can help. <laughs> Was that? It's a uh, new plasmid. Let's me lets me bring in things that might exist, but uh, don't. I'm not sure I understand. What's it called? Tear. Where'd you find that? You don't expect a girl to share all her secrets, do you, Mr. DeWitt? Freeze your enemies. Shatter them into a thousand pieces. far enough without a few answers. My purpose here is none of your concern. Consider me a means to an end. And why do I get the feeling I'm being set up? I told you I'm in collections. An account is in arrears. My clients simply want to see matters set to right. Don't make any sense, that's all. If you don't like the arrangement, the bathosphere's back that way.
Let's get down to it! Sally's not your daughter. What's she to you? Why risk life and limb? This is part of the job. You owe me no explanation. She's just another orphan. After Fontaine went down, city was lousy with her. And? I don't know. You have a reason for every stupid thing you've ever done? She started showing up, looking peaked. More fool me to feed the brat. Should have known she would have never leave. How did you lose her? It's none of your business. said right. Yes? When Peggy was the rapture type, not even a little. If you mean I have no interest in joining the Andrew Ryan book club, you'd be right. Just another set of fanatics with a different set of books. It's the king and country crowd who light the torch of destruction. I gamble. What? You asked me how I lost Sally. I gamble. Took her somewhere kids got no business being. I was winning place like that you don't let a kid out of your sight but you did yeah and here we are but the million dollar question is what's she to you I have an interest in reuniting you with her isn't that reason enough let's hope Cohen was on the level when he said this is where we'd find Sally I can only imagine what they would do with a child in a place like this. Cohen's halfway to Splice Town. Probably thought putting a child in prison would be high art. The sooner we find her, the better. Come on, Sally! Hopper's got balls. Now 
You come out and take your medicine. Sally, come out of there. I can't see her. What are you doing? This is a schematic for the venting system. It shows there are more vents like this one in electronics, the bistro, returns, the book department, and the appliance show floor. So? If she's in there, there are only six vents she can come out of. Now there are five. All these vents are connected to the central heating unit. If we close them off and turn the heat up, she'll be forced out through the central exhaust. It's the only exit. You want to burn her alive? No, we just to make it hot enough to flush her out. You can't do that. Look, either we find her, or one of those splicers will. All right. Where are the other vents? Up ahead. <laughs> This. Oh, this won't take long at all. All done. Come on, love. Uh, some fella nearby? Some fella? What are you trying to pull me? Uh, better leave well enough, huh? Ah. Uh. We need to close these vents. Having of the future, huh? Yeah, the kid got a hold of that damn radar range last night. Started trying it out on everything. Apples, marshmallows, spoons. Had himself a fine time until our peak at ease stepped in the way. And for some reason, I'm the one in touch with the wife. Well, I locked the damn thing up. Oh, uh, so don't forget the code. It's 3958.
Elizabeth! Sure thing. Paper. Spine on me again. Enough of this! Observation number 17, regarding unknown phenomena. Phenomena presents is odd shimmer, to which is observed... What? Men in strange hats. Women in large dresses. Buildings that float. Is phenomena window to other space? Other time? What was it Einstein said? The only reason for time is so not everything happen at once. Elizabeth? Looks simple enough. Oh, isn't everything just there? The food, the band. <laughs> Even your parents are behaving. <laughs> uh, really? You mean it? <laughs> I tried so hard to reduce to fit into this gown. I don't know if she was dangerous. Just insane. Next time, I'll be sure to ask.
Sally? Sally, it's me, Booker. Now, you come out now. S Sally? Dear, do, do you hear me? It's, it's me, Booker. Now listen, dear. You come out right now! Mr. DeWitt, she's not coming. Now let's get the rest of these vents sealed. It's the only way. Right. It's locked. I can do that. It's done. There should be one more. Taking so long. I, just, I can't get there. Come on. I'm just, I'm sure. Just give me a second.
Observation number 22, regarding unknown phenomena. What is the source of phenomena? Su Chong employ observers. Observer task to find more phenomena. Observer reports back, young woman appear from phenomena. And just as soon, young woman disappear. Observer has nothing else to report on topic. If Su Chang can find this woman, she will make interesting new phenomena. Close all the vents, we just need to turn up the thermostat and flush the girl out.
Use them. Designed to cook a turkey or a splicer. Damn door's got a key code lock. No way to get in without knowing what it is. Head back to the toy department. You see what a success you that is. You see how well it
Let me go check the exhaust vent. Open it. Okay. No sign of her. Looks like we'll need to turn up the thermostat if we're gonna flush her out. It's over that way. Thermostat's right there. Turn the heat up. I'm not going to burn her. It's the only way to bring her to us. If you won't do it, I will. Just give me the word. Turn it up. What? Turn the goddamn thermostat up. <sighs> do you hear that? We need to get back to the exhaust before we lose the girl again. Sally, come out! It isn't working. I told you she's coming. It isn't working. Turn if it we off. If turn it off, it's not gonna work. We have to turn it off. We are hurting her. <laughs> Sally! <laughs> Sally? Sally, it's Booker. It's me. Sally, come on. I'm gonna get you out of here. <laughs> Sally! Come out here right now. Yeah. Sally. No. Do it. Come to see you. We're going home. 
Do you want to go home? Don't fight, please. Don't. I'm here. I just want to take you home. I just want to get her back. You're hurting her. She's come with me. She's not your child. She is mine. Let her go. Let her go. She's mine. The jail is closing. Shut it down. Shut down the machine. You've got to pull her through. Pull. Shut down the machine. No, she's not through. Pull me. Shut it down. No, 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 no. wasn't yours, Comstock. No, no. I wasn't. No, no, no. Yet you had to have me, didn't you? No, this isn't right. And when the guilt no. was too much... You turned to us to solve your problem. To provide a place to go where you might forget. Where there never was an Anna in the first place. Comstock was never one to own up to his errors, was he, brother? Never comfortable with the choices he made. Always seeking someone else's life to claim as his own. Elizabeth. Child. I am so sorry. No, you're not. You're about to be. Mademoiselle? Yes? Quel est votre nom? Elizabeth. Pour vous, Elizabeth. Oh, no. No, I, I, I couldn't. I, I can't accept... Je vous en prie. J'insiste. Oh, thank you. Bonjour, Monsieur Surat. Bonjour, Mademoiselle Elizabeth. Je manque d'inspiration aujourd'hui. Bonjour, Elisabeth. Bien le bonjour. Bonjour, mon ami. Alors, tu as parlé à la jolie petite américaine Oh, bonjour, mademoiselle. Bonne journée. Comment ça va, Elisabeth Bonne journée. Et si tu venais boire un verre avec nous Claude Sois pas jalouse, ma petite C'est pas interdit pour un homme de boire avec deux jolies filles Viens jouer avec nous, Elisabeth I'm sorry, Cassette. Next time, I promise Oh, dommage Bien le bonjour, mademoiselle Je peux vous vendre tous les livres que vous voulez et pour pas cher en plus. Do you have the Age of Innocence by Edith Wharton? Désolé, ma petite, celui-là n'a pas encore été écrit. Bonjour, mademoiselle. Bonjour, Bonjour, Elisabeth. Bonjour. Il va falloir que tu me quittes parce que je me suis perdu dans tes yeux. <rire> Une baguette, mademoiselle? Sally, 
wait! Come back! Come back! Wait! Sally, stop! Come back! <laughs> Sally, where are you going? This ain't a sporting event. Put a bullet in her. No need to torture the poor girl. We're not animals, you know. All right, all right. Let her go! Quiet down, dear. In a minute, all your problems will be over. Elizabeth, tell him you can get him back. Booker? Uh, Booker, what? Say, I don't I understand. Get, How? Say, I can get you back to Rapture. What? Just say it. I can get you back to Rapture. Put the gun down. Now, what was that you said about Rapture? I can get you back to Rapture. And how you plan on doing that, sister? You some kind of magician? Su Chong. What? Tell him Su Chong. Su Chong. And how do you know that slant-eyed wonder? You're his lab assistant. I'm his lab assistant. If it escaped your notice, Andrew Ryan sunk us 5,000 fathoms below his shining city. How does Su Chong propose to get us back? That's between me. That's between me. And the slant. And the slant. But if I do this, the girl goes with me. Little sisters are worth their weight in gold. She's not up for negotiation. Last time I checked, back in the city they were making little sisters by the dozen. That's a right fairy tale you've dreamed up, sister. But if you're lying, we can just as well kill you tomorrow. Down here, we got nothing but time. In case I need to get hold of you. If you see Su Chong, tell him. Atlas says he hasn't forgotten him. of me felt. All of that knowledge. I lost to Pinky, but that version of me, she lost everything. In Comstock, 
That final Comstock, he thought he could avoid his guilt by coming here. You educated him proper. But then why am I back here? Huh? I don't remember opening a tear to come back. And who are you? Huh? I think you'll figure that out soon enough. Dealing with this Atlas, this this psychopath. What was I thinking? That wasn't Paris any more than I am, Booker. Now I have to find this this Su Chong, and I don't even know who that is. Not yet, but you know he's the key, don't you? To what? You're asking me, Elizabeth. I ain't even here. doors. What's behind the doors? I, I can't see the future. I can't even see any tears. Uh. <gasps> oh my god. S stay away from me. Booker. No. No. No, please. Please, no. I died here. I was killed by that... Stay away from me! But then... How am I... here? How can I be dead in this world and yet... My finger... What am I? Huh? I don't understand! I... I... If we're going to end up in the same place, we need to calm and to find. Are you being cute? I've come round to your way of thinking. Have you? Yes. I do believe one can change things. But after all the bother, one often wishes that one had not. You're a fatalist. A physicist. A fatalist. So was Newton. Especially when it came to apples falling from trees. They always contrived to land with a splat. She left the child to rot. Are you implying she's the apple? I'm implying that she did not fall far from the tree. And now she wants to go back. I need to go back. To fix what I broke. Back to where she has no right to be. Back to where she doesn't belong. Doesn't belong? Wait, what do you mean? Do you want to tell her brother, or shall I? Because I died. There are rules. Even for one such as you. She'll forget. All the doors. And what's behind all the doors. All close to her now. She'll be just like the rest of us. Forgetting the past. The present. The future. I'd wager she won't even remember this conversation. We've arrived. You're trading omniscience and croissants for death and mildew. I left Sally to rot. For what? So I could punish Comstock? He was trying to help her, to save her, and I... If I don't make that right... We all have our crosses to bear. But there is a thin line between a martyr and a fool.
Lutessas warned me that if I came back here, I would collapse. Collapse? From a, a quantum superposition to just me. The quantum what? I've changed, Booker. No tears, no cosmic knowledge. Just a normal girl. With a normal pinky. Hate it. If I can't open tears, I... I'm never leaving here, am I? I... I'm never going back to Paris. You... And you, you're just... You're, you're just what? You're, you're just the fragments of my memory telling me what my future holds? You decided to come here, Elizabeth. You knew what that meant. Only option as I see it is to trust yourself. Find Su Chong. It's only going to get worse. And how much worse is up to you. Children, the clay, Bradburn. It's up to us to see they become Grecian urns and don't return to the mud. Get them young enough. <laughs> and you can mold them for life. Henry, fetch that black label back. Now, let's get his lockpick. can be easy with the right tools and know-how. Use your lockpick to probe a pin. A neutral pin will open the door. A blue pin will open the door and knock free a noisemaker. A red pin will open the door, but also sound an alarm. Simple enough, just a six-pin tumbler. But there's an alarm. I could come in handy, though. Hello, 
children. I'm Ryan the Lion. I'm here to tell you about Peter the Parasite. If I bake a pie, isn't it mine to enjoy? No, says Peter the Parasite. <laughs> peace. What was that? You know, don't you? The, the doors, the, they're, they're cracking open. My memories of the future, and, and, and somewhere I'm going to go. You sure it's your future you're looking at? If not mine, then... Then whose? Is it my concern that others cannot? No, says the... Crossbow. Looks like the bolt delivers some kind of sleep agent. Probably fencyclidine or sodium thiopental. <laughs> they had all kinds of books in my tower. How do you think I always knew what ammo to toss you? No one. Ain't the same as being ready. Why don't you ask Comstock how ready I was? Your father's blood runs in your veins, but it doesn't have to be on your hands. And it's up to you. Find it in the dictionary under L I E. Criminal dealings? Ha! Fallacy and misdirection from those afraid to let the market take its natural course. Prosperous, determined, uncompromising, then fine. The shoe fits. You got me. First, a law gets bribery. Then, you'll want some fella in my privy advising how I defecate. Look, Suchong, 
That's the name you had me tell Atlas. Huh. I don't follow. Looks like this character, Su Chong, has taken over the Silverfin restaurant. That's... That's where the tear was that I used when I first came to Rapture looking for Comstock. Before this place was turned into a prison. But the first time you came to Rapture was in 1960, with Booker. When you drowned some... Over a year from now. Yeah, that... that that's right, I... When I could see all the doors, it, it all made sense, but now... Now it's, it's just a jumble. Elizabeth, you're, you're bleeding. Now I know what it feels like. All right, if we're gonna find Su Chong, the Silverfin is the place to start. I know the way. here as well. Right after I came through, I needed... I needed something to wear that was a little more rapture appropriate. your letter regarding our new line of peeping tom plasmids and wish to respond thusly. Tough luck. This is rapture, miss. What my customers do with my product is their business. If you are feeling uncomfortable, you are more than welcome to line the walls of your home in lead. If you wish, I could direct you to a reputable supplier. Disappear from sight, see through walls, and sneak up on your foes. Child's time. Child's time. I told Santa Cole I'm always ready to cut a Splicers. I could use Sneak this plasmid and see them through the walls, or if worse comes to worse, turn completely invisible and get the drop on them. for lockers with actual locks on them. I come back from lunch, and the ensemble I just bought is gone. Stolen! But here's what takes the cake. 
the thief left an outfit in exchange. At first, I was going to toss that thing, but then I kind of fell in love with it. <laughs> it's an old-timey number with a corset, no less. It ain't exactly today's fashion, but I'm a girl who can tell good craftsmanship when she sees it. I wasn't really happy there. We'd all be better off, us to wits, if we could leave well enough alone. Yep. Yep. Let's get everything in order, shall we? I want to go to Cohen's. I want to go to Cohen's. <laughs> Reminder. Wanting an item from the service is forgivable. Buy a Every possible moment. And now... You're just like everyone else. Why? Why, because I died here? If I'm just like everyone else, I can't help Sally. I can't even get back to where I was. If you don't mind me asking, love, why are you talking to nobody? If I had pegged you for a loon, I might have had second thoughts on our arrangement. I'll hold up my end, but I better find the girl the way I left her. You're in no position to make demands. But I must confess, I do like a bit of sass in a lass. Oh, 
killed me. You can't trade blows with him. Comstock put him down and he got right back up. I can't hurt him. I could keep my distance, but if I watched myself, he could come in handy. Enemy of my enemy. What do you want? Let me in. I'm working with Atlas. I ain't heard nothing. Nobody gets you in there without a kind word from the boss. Won't have any horseplay. Get out! Uh. This fella Atlas has been making the rounds down here, trying to bring some kind of order to this pit. All the splicers think the man walks on water, but something about him smells stink to me. Reminds me a bit of my former employer, Frank Fontaine. Always talking about how he was going to lift Rapture right out of the old man's wallet. No fuss, no muss. See where that got him. Silver Finn. This used to be a restaurant when I first came through. Now it belongs to this Su Chong. Looks like I'm not the first one who tried to get in here. Well, at least he left a trail. Tried to break into Su Chong's. Huh. What's this? Hmm. Well, seems like central heating came from this room, so it would stand a reason that the ductwork should go to Su Chong's. Wait a minute. To give and not demand anything in return. Why? Who benefits, class? Someone who wants what you have. 
free from effort. A president, leader of hope, a parasite. Su Chong wasn't exactly a master of subterfuge. Our man. No sign of him now. Either he's dead or working for Ryan. Columbia. He knew about Columbia. And and Booker and and me. The Sutron must have found a way to reopen the tear I made to come here. to reopen the tear. Look, the tear still leads back to Columbia. Plasmids, Vigors. He and Fink must have been in communication, sharing secrets. Like the Lutesses before they were physically together. Why did I need to come here? What does this have to do with Sally? You remember, don't you? It hasn't happened yet? I told you, I can't do that. Concentrate, Elizabeth. No, the doors are shut there. I use the Lutest particle if, if it can make a city float. It can make a prison rise. I can't open tears, but we could use this device to go to Columbia and find a particle. But it's been vandalized. You'll fix it. Sure. You know, my tower didn't come stock with the Lutest device repair manual. You will fix it. Yeah, I'll just... Elizabeth, you will fix it. Okay. Okay, there must be some information. Sodium, titanium. Why would these be on schematics for its code? A visionaire cipher. If if we assume hydrogen is A and iron the 26th element is C. You always used to need a code key. Or... It's right here. Never underestimate the fallibility of the egomaniac. Looks like a punch list for things Su Chong needs to fix the machine. A cold cathode tube. A carbon dioxide scrubber. A heat sink. Any of the vending machines should have the cathode tube. And we can look for a CO2 scrubber in the bathosphere showroom. A lot of models should have them. A heat sink. Oh, that's... We're in a department store. Are we gonna find... Keep your cool with old man Winter. That'll work. 
Time to find those parts. And then I just have to repair the most sophisticated piece of technology ever created. Elizabeth, you saw yourself make this repair. You can do this. Whatever you say. Guess we better find our way out of here. Atlas, you there? I need a favor. A favor? I don't suppose you've conjured up the miracle you promised, yes? I'm working on it. I'm gonna need some old man winter. You might try where they hawk them new bathospheres. As I hear it, old man winter's the only thing keeps their batteries from bursting into flames after five minutes. Thanks. Think nothing of it, but it's the last favor you'll be getting. Problem. Big Daddy will not imprint on the little brats. Yet Fink succeeded in imprinting his disgusting bird on his subject. How has Fink, the stupid man, succeeded where Su Chang failed? If Su Chang could obtain hair sample of Fink's subject, Su Chang could determine delta of genetic material with little sister. Proof is in DNA pudding. out of my own restaurant. And that Korean had the run of the place. <laughs> it was a good business, I tell you. I never should have told anyone about that light. About those weird buildings I saw floating in the clouds. And most of all, I never should have told no one about that girl who showed up one day in that old tiny blue dress. I suppose you'd be Su Chong. Save your ammunition, your device doesn't work. Device will work? Vandal sabotage! You are Vandal! Actually, I intend to fix your device. That is, unless you plan on coming down here and doing it yourself. It's not prudent for Su Chong to return to lab. And you say you can fix I broke your code, didn't I? Now just give me the one to open that door and we'll see what your creation can do. One, two, one, six. Your birthday? Enough of talk. Fix the machine. How'd you know that? Never underestimate the fallibility of the egomaniac. I'm just honored to be in the competition, and gee, I hope you like me. Because I'd like nothing more than to be this rapture and not be. First, the law gets bribery. Then, you'll want some balance. Stick together. Yes, sir. That's correct, sir. I'm ready. Everyone wants a pick. Hope I do you a proud, Kane.
hiding in the corner won't help. Who's there? <laughs> You left me with nothing! You got a friend over? <laughs> Nice shoes. You, you like this? Glenda, Glenda, Glenda. She's got to know. I know. She's got to.
Cooper. Ah! I ain't letting a good lead like you get away! I didn't say you could go! Stop following me! anyone would be able to bring all these degenerate splice heads in the line. I gotta hand it to Atlas. After Ryan locked us up in this pit, I thought that was it. Just a long final dive into the abyss. But he's given us hope. Or what passes for it down in Rapture. When a person's gotten up. Hope's about the kindest thing you can give her. Or the cruelest. I sell something. <laughs> Like some cognitive print.
No one around? Seems I still have the ability to scare off the patient. If we seek out the fight, That only seems to be knocking them back. You're only gonna do real damage that way if they don't see you coming. CO2 scrubber. Welcome to the Circus of Value! No refund, no return! Elizabeth, this poster. What's this all about? Cohen. Spent two months as his disciple, trying to get a line on his trafficking ring. Awful. Why not just kill Comstock and be done with it? Comstock had to know why. He had to know that he deserved it. Did he? Did he deserve it? I suppose we all do. One way or another. A man makes a parasite. 
takes. Such an easy meal. Look long and hard enough, the parasite will reveal itself. Looks like someone's been decrypting a code. We've confirmed completion of the ace in the hole. Su Chong has it, but unlikely to give it up easily. We'll update when we know more. What's that all about? Hypnotize Big Daddy. Coming next year. Oh, of course. Another coded message. Attempt to retrieve Ace in the Hole from Su Chong unsuccessful. Ryan Private Security killed three of our men in the bargain. We'll need to explore alternate means of obtaining Ace.
Old Man Winter. That's how a we'll cool suit jumps machine. Yeah? Atlas sent me here for some Old Man Winter. You haven't been around here long, have you? What makes you say that? Because <laughs> eh, you're the only one of us who don't smell like the reptile house at the zoo. Now be quick about it, and just take the winner. This ain't the Goodwill. Memo to the sales team. While we deny all customer claims regarding purported burns they have received from, quote, overheating of 1958 bathyspheres, unquote, our marketing team has decided to give away flasks of Old Man Winter as part of a new promotional campaign. There will be no recall of the 58. No recall. So, uh, so Atlas asked me to figure out where to uh, strike first when we bust out of this place, but, you know, it all depends on when we get out. You know, I mean, November 5th, it's a big founding of Rapture Shindig at uh, Fort Frolic. Valentine's Day, you know, I mean, Arcadia is real popular. Uh, I mean, it's near New Year's Eve, and, hey, we could pop the corks off all the stuffed shirts down at the Kashmir restaurant. Tell Ryan things are getting hot down here real fast. The goddamn leprechaun is building himself a regular army. You know, if you'd asked my opinion, which you didn't, I'd send a crew down here and clean up the place before they show up on your doorstep. But who am I except some undercover schmuck you sent to give you straight dope? Whereabouts of the foreign bitch scientist unknown. Ryan presumes she's dead, but our guess is she's gone underground with the little sisters. Options on obtaining the ace are dwindling. your enemies. Shatter them into a thousand pieces. Just what we needed. All we need now is a CO2 scrubber. I'm gonna say thank you. Who the hell are you? <laughs> I made you a solid
atmospheres, there's bound to be CO2 screws. And why is that? If you don't remove the carbon dioxide from the air supply in a submersible, suffocate. One thing I did like about Rapture, lots of new books to read. That will need a long haul bathosphere, something where the CO2 buildup would limit the submersible period. Before. I've seen it. Everything. That will happen. And now. Now. I only see darkness. You sent yourself here for a reason. A debt. That's what you want to call it. This Atlas. I'm gonna have to kill him. Either that or he'll kill me. Maybe so. I'm not you, Booker. Some war hero. I'm not even me anymore. No tears, no omniscience, or whatever you want to call it. Just a whole lot of book learning. And a handful of lockpicks. The Humpback Whale. Thing is as old as the hills. Strictly bargain basement. You gotta wear an O2 tank and a mask. We won't find a scrubber on that. Known fatalities related to its use, carbon dioxide poisoning, and they're still on the market. Well, steeply discounted, though. There, the stingray. Submersible time of 90 minutes. That's our girl. All the way up there. The grease monkeys had to get it up there somehow. Just gotta find the controls. All of these jerks, meat puppets, Kara, all of them. I'm the only one who's the score. Child star. Child star. No! 
Or nothing. Ryan's playing them all like a cheap Dundee. fiddle. Poor Dundee. He plays. Poor Dundee. You know how they dance. Intellectual superhumans who, in the act of their ball, will destroy the old world of Complete revolution. One mind at a time. I know they're talking about me. Without the snarl. What happens when you're not careful? You become fixed. See you again. These new songs. They're real personal to me. And I The buildings are being fabricated above the waves. But we will lower them on a lunette ring submerged into the structure's steel frames. So much steel, you wonder. How will we keep so large a purchase from the government? Water is buoyant. We shall not frame rapture in steel, but in aluminium. The government jackals may suspect me of building an air force, but never a city. No excuse for a racket. Come out and show yourself. Atlas, the heat is on. Ryan knows something's up and is sending men to investigate the department store. Suggests you lay in supplies at the Manta Ray Lounge and prepare for a siege. Hmm. Looks like there's something in the Manta Ray Lounge worth investigating. Come on! Let's work something out! You're not 
a switch around here somewhere. Seen quantum field generators since kindergarten. Well, well, what was that? You give him my message. Any progress, love? I must confess, I'm becoming a wee bit skeptical. Remind me, why am I supposed to care? You see, me lads have taken a keen thirst for Adam. And there's a vintage right in front of me that'll do nicely. If you kill her, I truly hope you are happy living down here. Put down roots, raise a family. Or maybe you think Andrew Ryan is going to ride to your rescue. Fair enough. But remember, there are fast ways to harvest little sisters, and some very slow ones.
Soon there's not going to be an ounce of booze or a piece of ass for the taking. <laughs> uh, sometimes I think you've taken this whole Robin Hood business a bit too much to heart. Fontaine's got us out there ladling soup for the purpose of building an army. Not to share the milk of human kindness. <laughs> you keep up that kind of behavior. I'm going to start thinking there's more red in you than Karl Marx. What the hell? Splicers. They're busting me! Hurwitz! Tell Fontaine the perimeter! in the hole. You think you can stiff Frank Fontaine? I paid good money for state-of-the-art weaponry. I ain't losing this war just because you found yourself a higher bidder. I can promise you, I ain't never been one to lose with dignity.
immediately die of CO2 poisoning the moment we turn it on. Well, not the perfect phosphor frequency, but it'll do. Must have a supply stashed here somewhere. Everything's fixed. We're ready. Let's fire it up and see. If I did everything correctly, all that's left should be pulling the lever at the front of the device. Lady Mark II was built around the particle lift system, just like all the buildings in the city. I read all about it in the Columbian Scientific. The particle seated at the top of the structure must be up that lift. Perfect. Like a lot of technology just to float an airship. Comstock never heard of hydrogen. The First Lady Mark I did run on hydrogen and it was destroyed by a single bullet from a Vox sniper. Unfortunately, the Prophet wasn't on board at the time. If I take the active particle, then the First Lady is just a 40-ton paperweight. Best to take the spare. Here we go. Now let's head back through that tear. You honestly expect Atlas to honor his side of the deal? No, but we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. How do you plan on handling Atlas? He ain't just some spliced-up maniac. He'll make a mistake. I just have to be ready to take advantage of it when it happens. Girl, you barely know. How well did you know me when you came to Columbia? Nothing but trouble that way. Best to head straight back to Rapture. Pretty lady not finished yet. What? Open the tear. Power for device, very expensive. Teach for that. Just tell me what you want. So Jomo wants something as simple. Lock of hair. Oh, you're not serious. Not your hair, stupid! Think Hodge's secret life. Mothballed, forgotten. In there, hair sample. In jar. Cannot miss it. You get for Sutra. Then, everybody friends. Where's his lab? Closed off past Fink's quarters. Um, you smart lady, you find it. Should've seen that one.
council. And you done me good service, but I will not hurt the boy. I will see Fink and Comstock burn, but I will not hold the son to account for the deeds of his father. You've misunderstood us. We neither asked you to harm the child. Nor did we promise that yours would be the hand that would set Comstock's world afire. A famous man once said... And a famous man shall say... I may reach the mountaintop. But I fear I shall never visit the valley below. But you mean I won't live to see the... No. It's up to you what matters more. Your part in the play. Or the play itself. Someone is coming. She'll arrive a girl. She must leave a woman. And what makes the difference between a girl and a woman? Blood. Your part in the play. Or the play itself. Turn her into a killer? How? Give the girl no choice. And she will be forced to make one. need. But sometimes I feel all I have to offer them is blood and fire. The things they've done to me, I can't forget them. I was Columbia's victim, and victimhood begets shame. Oh, what element of human experience is more corrosive than shame? I'm rotted from the inside out. For this revolution except my own dark motivations when all is said and done what's more important to me the people i want to save are those i want to murder in their beds
your order. Who's out there? Back here. Down. Two of them press eyes. Ah! 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 
goddamn sea slugs. Could that Oriental have come up with a more inconvenient fuel for his plasmids? If there is a god, and I've seen more evidence to the contrary than in support, you'd think he'd have put Adam into the belly of a nice little seagull or crow. The cost of all these underwater expeditions are murdering my margins! As to the matter of religion, let me place myself in the camp of the agnostic. I pretend to understand the mysteries of the infinite no more than you, Comstock, or anyone else for that matter. But for the sake of argument, let's say this is all one unhappy accident, and we all alone in our toils. Then who would Comstock use to control and shame us with rules that apply only to those with not a penny in their pocket? If there were no God, you could rest assured the first deed done by the first rich man would be inventing him. Idiot, his lock of hair. Listen, I got you your gun. I'm here for my ass. But my Booker DeWitt died for the Fox Populi. You either an imposter or a ghost. My book of the wit was a hero to the cause, a story to tell your children. Humor me then? Please. I think Booker would miss you.
been here. Say, somebody, uh, fetch me a millionaire to clean this mess up. There's nothing to be worried about, but I don't like the smell of things down in Finkton. Not one bit. If trouble rears its ugly head in the form of one cantankerous negress, I've laid in some supplies in the event of a forced evacuation. They're down in what I call my chamber of panic, near the base of my statue. I've set the code to 8371. Comstock promises there's nothing to be worried about, but I don't like the smell of things down in Finkton. Not one bit. If trouble rears its ugly head in the form of one cantankerous negress, I've laid in some supplies in the event of a forced evacuation. They're down in what I call my chamber of panic, near the base of my statue. I've set the code to 8371. Here's 
kill her to, to turn me in to turn me into what a killer yeah well mission accomplished i'm no martyr how did you do it booker how did you elizabeth i'm not booker and neither am i Now, I know there's been some concern about the nature of the work we do here at Fink Manufacturing. Why, some say they're uncomfortable with the purported harm and suffering our research brings. But friends, let me pose a simple question. Is there anything you would not do to guarantee the health and safety of your loved ones? My interest is the future health of your children. An ounce of prevention is worth a pound of cure.
yourself! Getting to the foxes are afraid of the hens. If Fink was going to hire a bunch of goons to keep an eye on the handymen, he should have found some with less yellow in the belly. Now they're hiding away from Tin Man invalids in their precious little guard room. If you need to get in there on your shift, the code is 2847. Foxes are afraid of the hens. If Fink was going to hire a bunch of goons to keep an eye on the handymen, he should have found some with less yellow in the belly. Now they're hiding away from Tin Man invalids in their precious little guard room. If you need to get in there on your shift, the code is 2847.
Fink and Su Chong were sharing their research. Like the Lutessas. Cross reality collaboration. It all makes a kind of sense. The little sisters and the big daddies. Songbird and me. Constants and variables. It's a wire mother. If you separate a gorilla from its real mother, it will imprint on almost anything. Even that. Why would Fink care about that? Songbird. <laughs> he wanted him to imprint on me. Well, if I recall, that was a problem he solved. Skeletal formula for oxytocin. That's the chemical that bonds mothers to children, women to men, and songbirds to little girls. Apparently not. Fink dismissed it as an unsuitable vector. These poor things. Fink couldn't get them to imprint. So I left them to die. Imprinting failed. Clearly, they formed a connection between Songbird and me. How? I was so young. I, I always remember him just being there. Prototype or something. Uh, is it human? Does it matter? I 
I tried hypnotherapy. On the songbird. How'd that go? About as well as you'd expect. he was in some sort of fight. I waited there thinking, thinking, I, I don't know, that something would happen, but, but he just lay there, moaning. I couldn't just... The line with the thorn in its paw. So much for science. I should have just left him there to die. I should have just... I will never escape it. Exploited, exploiting, me, Comstock, you, Sally. It's like a wheel of blood spinning round and round. Well, this must be the genetic sample Su Chong wanted. He sent you all the way back here for a sample of your own hair. He doesn't know I was once the child that imprinted on Songbird. But to him, all the answers lie in DNA. Men like Su Chong mistake an ounce of empathy for a pound of science. <laughs>
has occurred to me that this breakthrough regarding the songbird casts my arrangement with the Oriental Doctor in a new light. What more could be gained by this continued partnership? What secrets that I could not answer for myself? Su Chong can only offer table scraps, and Jeremiah Fink has richer meat in mind. About now, I'm planning a pair of scissors in her bag to protect a child she was never going to harm. She chose to die for her revolution. What about me? For all the endless worlds, all the infinite possibilities. Did I ever even have a choice? Did you? Yeah. Booker thought he did. Look where it got us. Right back where we started. All these infinite universes. And yet we end up just going down the same paths. Now I'll take your meaning. My father sold me to settle a marker. Comstock locked me up in a tower. And I sold Sally for what? Revenge to prove a point? And yet, here you are, settling the debt. And say we find her. The old past their damage to the young. Isn't it too late for her now? Well, I'd say that's up to her to decide. Just as coming back here was up to you. Rapture runs on children. Little girls with gold growing in their bellies. I'm not gonna break any cycle. If I'm lucky, maybe I can dent it. Just a little.
pretty lady has the hair? Deal is deal. Bring it to Suchong. Pretty lady put hair sample in two. Then, business is finished. What's going on out there? Bloodshed, violence, but not relevant to our arrangement. Su Chong! Su Chong, we had a deal now. Open. You know what they call someone who enters a man's home uninvited? A thief. And I do not remember inviting you into my city. I had a deal with Su Chong. He Su Chong is my employee. It was not a deal he was authorized to make. What do you want? I granted Atlas and his thugs asylum. You serve those same men in a desire to escape from my generosity. If they shall not have asylum, then they shall have liquidation. Give a parasite an ounce of charity, they'll demand a pound. I'm just looking for a girl that was taken from me. A little sister. I don't claim to understand what you are, but I know that you are special. There is business we can do together. And so, I give you a choice. Work for me, or die with Atlas. I'm not going anywhere without that girl. If it's a little sister you want, that shouldn't stand in the way of commerce. I've got dozens of them. I won't leave without her. My men stand ready to take down the door. In 60 seconds, they will enter the room. They will either treat you as a valued employee of Ryan Industries, or as a thief in the night. 60 seconds. There must be half a dozen of them or more. I've got to get ready. No traps. I can use the plasmids as traps and then seed the room with them. i got to find somewhere to hide and surprise them. Take them down one by one. They'll underestimate you, Elizabeth. People always do. Forty seconds. You know what I see on your face? Uncertainty. Who is this girl to you? Thirty seconds. Do you know the value of the shark? Without them, she would be littered with the detritus of the weak. The men who come for you have much in common with those great animals. What sharks do for the ocean, these men do for rapture. Twenty seconds. I will tell you something you already sense. Atlas does not honor agreements. Andrew Ryan does. I cannot save your Sally, but I can save you. Time. You're not a hero. You're not even a parasite. You're just a room. And Andrew Ryan has no time for rooms. Who's there? They're down for the count. I know you Get done. back here! Sweetheart, not so long as I'm here. You're not all easy targets, you get me? This one's down for the kick. You're not. I know you've done it. That's how it's gonna be? There. What was that?
Better you than me, pal. I'm not taking the next bullet. Where is she? Lady! You're working my last turn! I wanna make short work of you! <laughs> Sharks, Ryan. The better man won. Isn't that the only thing you respect? Now let me the hell out of here. Sounds like all hell breaking loose out there. What's your plan? I can't just place the particle on the ceiling. It would just tear right through it. But every building in Rapture was submerged into the ocean on a lunette ring, connected to the junction of its load-bearing supports. Fascinating and all, but if you haven't noticed, Ryan sent his goons to murder us. If you're gonna pull a rabbit out of a hat, now's the time to do it. Looks like the structural junction is in Frank Fontaine's office. If I can get there, I can float the building. It so happens I've taken that bastard's office for my own use. I'll make sure you've access to the private elevator. Now hurry. A brunette. Anyone see? When I find you, I won't roll over for you. I heard that. Enough. Nobody here. Where is she? Lady, you're working my last nerve. I know. And I'm ready. Are you sure? I sent myself here for a reason. Didn't I? And who exactly are you speaking to, Miss Comstock? If I were less acquainted with the vicissitudes of genius, I suspect I would question your sanity. I know so little of you, but I imagine the more I learned, the more exceptional I would find you. You know Atlas will betray you. And what are you, my best friend? You're one of a kind in this world, or others. And now, your misguided sense of altruism sends you to your doom. 
It's like watching Isaac Newton die in a house fire. A vain attempt to save his cat. All the load-bearing columns come into this room and they meet... They meet there. I just need to place the particle in that junction, activate it, and the whole structure should rise. Anybody's got the line on the ace. It's her. Find out what she knows. But no quackery. She's no good to us with a halo and a set of wings. I get started as soon as the chloroform wears off. Don't see her as too tough a nut. What? What? Where's the ace in the hole? I don't... I don't know what you're talking about. Look, we had a deal. Where I... is the ace in the hole? I told you. I told Sodium did... Falpentol. Are you familiar? <clears throat> no. Truth serum. Unpredictable stuff. <sighs> To little nothing. I have Too nothing much. to tell the you. I don't even you know what an ace in the hole is. I am still playing uh, with the dosage. Uh, for you too. I tend to your own knitting if I were you. Now, darling, being that you were Su Chong's lab assistant and all, why not tell me where me ace in the hole went to? I don't know. As I said, I'm no doctor. But that doesn't mean I don't find the field fascinating. I keep up on all the medical journals and the like. 
I hope you have someone to help you with all the big words. You know what part of the brain free will comes from? Stubbornness. The prefrontal lobe. Now, I think it's fair to say you're a bit of a stubborn one, are you not? A man named Steinman taught me this. He's a bit of a lunatic, but a fine surgeon. He calls this little trick a transorbital lobotomy. Take hold of her, lads. You're wasting your now, time. If you won't remain still, I can't be held responsible for what comes next. Here we go. You feel that? I'm moving the pick across your eyeball. Still now. And resting it on your skull. There's about a bit over a quarter of an inch of bone between the pick and your prefrontal lobe. And that's where this little fella comes in. I don't. Oh. It was just a wee tap. But I don't expect it'll take more than a few of those to reach the meat. And then we might find you a bit less the mule. Where's me ace in the hole? I don't know. You know right. what else rests in the lobe? Creativity. Uh, Individuality. Uh, personality. Uh, in short, what makes you, you. Uh, <sighs> I'm just about through now. Last chance, pet. Where is the ace in the hole? <laughs> or what? What, you'll put a hole in my head and take away my memories? You want to make me forget all this? You want to make me not care anymore? Go ahead. You'll be doing me a favor. Oh! <laughs> Bring in the monster! You're a regular hero, ain't you? Can't risk ripping the only part of you that's worth a damn. Well, there's more than one way to fry an egg. Now, little woman, are you familiar with the term transorbital lobotomy? Please let her it's go! It's a simple matter. All I need to is insert this pig in please, your eye. Please, I don't know and anything! a few I... taps with me hand. I don't know anything! Better to show by example. Please! Please don't! I, I don't know anything! I, I don't know! Please! Tell him what I don't know. Where are we? You saw all the doors. And what's behind all the doors. The ace in the hole. It's here. Yes. But, but I don't... I don't remember this place. You've never been here. Then how would it... The memories you lost, they weren't just of the past. You saw behind all the doors. Even the ones into the future. If you want. I... I don't like it here. It's a bad place. He's never gonna let me go, is he? Even if I bring him the ace. Then why am I here? How if I was so smart? If I saw so much, why just send myself to the slaughter? For Sally. No, one day he will just rip her open and tear out her atom. All of this for nothing. Why did I do it? Why? You have to decide. Decide what? To take a leap of faith. I can't tell you what you were thinking because you don't remember. But you chose to come. There. In that room. The Ace. I don't know what to do, Booker. I... B Booker? Booker! No, please. Please just don't leave me here! Chong's clinic. That's a bit convenient now. Ryan's got every turret in the place tuned to me and me man's genetic code. 
We'd be torn to shreds before we got ten feet. That's right. Which is why I'm gonna do it for you. You okay with that? Get me the ace. I'll wrap the brat in a silk ribbon. Bag her and bring her to my bathosphere. <sighs> Lads, I'll show you how to get inside. <coughs> we'll be waiting for you where you come out. Shake a leg now. The Lord hates a laggard. We're burning through ten times the amount of atom compared to the injectables. And if you fail to notice, them sea slugs ain't exactly growing on trees. Switch back to the injectables and let the eggheads in marketing worry about selling it to the chumps. You, I, I don't. No, he's, he's just hurt. He, he just needs somebody to, to, to figure out how to fix him. I, maybe there's some, I don't know. Is there some documentation for him around here or something? Right. Look who I'm asking. beast had a half brain, they would realize they need little sister to live. Sisters secrete only kind of atom that is genetic match for them. No little sister, no big daddy. Scary, 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 scary. I've got to do something. Big monster sick. Big monster it's okay, sick. it's it's okay, please. I, I don't know how to help him. He needs Adam. I, I don't have any of that. Big I don't know what to do. Going to die. Not fair. We can help.
that your puppy? She's very pretty. Thank you, Papa Sushan. Break her neck for me. What? Break that sweet puppy's neck. No, please. Break that puppy's neck. Would you kindly? No. No. Suchong, of all the things I know, I know this. It is in your power to be a different man. What can Ryan take from us that we have not already sacrificed at the altar of discovery? They are children, little sisters, and yes, they will forget. But you and I won't. The memories of what we have done fade only with the dimming of all lights. Tenenbaum. the genetic sequence to uh, sequence to allow for get away you fitty little shit what what are you doing get back get back the death for this. Keen to get this brat off me hands. You know what? Andrew Ryan said I was a rube. But he was wrong. I'm not the rube, Atlas. You are. Now, we both know what happens next. Just get it over with. Well, love, if you insist. this? It's just a bunch of gibberish. What, what does, does this say, you little whore? Hey, 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 hey! What does this say?
We've got the activation phrase. Now all we've got to do is get that genetic freak of nature on an airplane and rapture's ours. Yeah! Save the world entire. This is you who are the safe. Hey, something, Kirkushosa. Hey, 